Hi, this is Ian with Sterilized Rotoplate Solutions. Today we are going to be changing the cassette steel for a Statum 2000. First thing we're going to do is separate the top from the bottom. Set the bottom off to the side. I'm going to use a flathead screwdriver and we're just going to dig down around one of the corners and it should pop that seal out. Once that seal's out, we're going to set that off to the side. We want to look where the cassette seal goes and make sure there is no rust. This one looks really good. I'm going to take the provided lubricant for the new seal and I'm going to pour about half this vial into the middle of the cassette. With our new seal, take a couple of fingers and we are just going to lubricate this entire seal. Go all the way around with it. You will see that there is two holes in the cassette seal and some nubs sticking up that the the holes should be in the back of the cassette we're just going to loosely set this in there like that i'm going to start in this corner lining up each nub and press it into place and we're going to do all four corners that exact same way i'm going to start on the back press this into place and i'm going to go to the front and do the same. Once that seals in, we want to look at the back and we are off just by a little bit. So I'm going to take a finger and put it between the grooves of the seal and pressing up and in, I'm just going to slide my finger all the way around this cassette seal. This will help set the seal. When we're done, we want to inspect, make sure all the corners are lined up all the way around the seal. Make sure that the back is lined up. I'm going to wipe off the extra lubricant that's in there. When you run a cycle, there will be residual water that sticks to the lid. That is because of that lubricant. You can use stat dry to help get rid of that water faster. Last thing I'm going to do, put the cassette together and give it the squish test. Give it a nice little squeeze. You should hear air blowing out the back. If you have any issues, please give us a call. 704-966-1650. Option three for free tech support. Thank you.